Hey, what's up guys? Thanks for joining me today. I just got out of work and um, figured it's still nice out, still have a little bit of sun left. Might as well take a hike, right? And uh, today we have a beautiful spot. Let me flip this around and uh, show you just where we're at. Well, if you're from the area, that tower right there should give you a clue to uh, where we're at. But let me just pan around for you. See where we're at. Today we're coming live from Dunmore, Pennsylvania. And uh, this here is Dunmore Reservoir number one. It's absolutely gorgeous here. It's one of my favorite spots that just come to get out, take in some nature. Yeah, it's absolutely stunning here. Come over here, take a look, see what the signs say. You could fish, no camping overnight, no fires, no fishing from the bridge. Like I said, we're here at Dunmore Reservoir number one. Come over here, you have a little poster, shows you the snakes and turtles of PA. And they also have a butterfly garden in the spring. Nice flowers bloom here and uh, I guess the attack attract the butterflies. But uh, this is the, this is what we're here for guys. Look at that. We have a beaver out there enjoying the dam today. I'll try to zoom in and get a little picture of him. That little buddy right there. <laughs> Just enjoying the, enjoying the beautiful day of fall here. All right, back on track. Now we're gonna take you a little closer to the reservoir. As I'll pan over, here's uh, the start of the trail. We'll be going shortly. This will take us up around, up around the reservoir. So we'll definitely, uh, definitely be making our way shortly. That way so yeah look how beautiful it is out here let's try to pan you around here Ooh, sun's just starting to set here oh yeah it's beautiful Yeah, it's absolutely gorgeous here. So, stick with me and um, we'll continue along once we get back to the trail. All right, guys, we're out on the main trail. And uh, yeah, we're just gonna head on. We're gonna take the loop. Like I said, it's a beautiful day. I just got out of work and um, I figure before the sun sets, it's still beautiful out. Might as well uh, take you guys on a little adventure. Yeah, it's very beautiful down here. Leaves everywhere. Yeah, it's a perfect place to take your pet. Take a nice little stroll after work like I am. 
Like I'll take you down here. It's even nice little spots. If you wanted to, you could. Woo. Come sit down, fish. Just come out. It's got a nice, peaceful views out here. All right, we'll continue on. Back to the main path. Yeah, it's a little, little noisy in the beginning of the trail. Like I said, we're right in front of the highway here. So it is a little noisy in the beginning, but it does taper off once you get towards the back section. So, just uh, come along and enjoy the views as we take a trip around the Dunmore Reservoir number one. All right, guys. All right, guys. We made it down the second part of the trail. And uh, we're now in the back of the reservoir. And I will uh, show you we get to a clearing in the back here. Take a nice look. But yeah, like I said, it's beautiful out here today. It's uh, low 40s. A little bit of wind, but beautiful day for a hike. It's just beautiful. Like I said, we're losing sunlight, but it'll be nice to see a sunset out here or the reservoir. Sorry if it's a little jumpy. Uh, the rocks are everywhere here. And now we come to, I want to say Little Roaring Brook, this is. This is what feeds Dunmore Reservoir number one, which is actually owned by the Pennsylvania Water Company who allowed the trail to be put in and allows access to it, so. Take a walk out this way before we continue on. Get a beautiful look at the reservoir. And some of that sun setting. Sorry guys, I'm trying to hold it steady, but there's boulders everywhere. But look at this. I mean, is this a view or what? 
And this is right in your backyard. If you live around here <laughs> in Dunmore. I mean, look at this. Stunning. It's actually so cold that it's starting to freeze in some places. It's pretty cool. But yeah, this is it here. This is beautiful. But can't stay too long. Like I said, once that sun goes down, that's it. But yeah, this is the terrain I'm walking over. It's not the best. But I mean, look at that. Just gorgeous. Oh, sorry for the sniffles here. It's getting a little chilly out. But let's cross. Let's cross over the brook. And let's continue on the way. All right, we just crossed the, the little creek and uh, now officially in the back of the uh, back of the reservoir now. Another good thing about this hike too is it's only maybe 15 minutes from my house. And the whole hike alone is maybe about 30, 45 minutes. So, stick with me here. Alright, so stick with me here and I will uh, pick up with you. We get around this bend here. Alright guys. We're now at the back, very back end of the reservoir. It's very mucky. <laughs> they made uh, some makeshift bridges out of here so you don't get too wet. And that one doesn't look to uh, have survived much. <laughs> Let's go. So now here at this back area, there is um, an off-road course for ATVs that goes behind the reservoir here that is used by American War Horse. I guess they test out their um, ATVs and such, but yeah, it's of course if you look back, it's all the way back in the distance back there. But I okay, guess so we're gonna continue on. Take you over. There's a little clearing here. Take you over and get another good shot at the back end of the reservoir. It's really got a pretty reflection. <laughs> Gorgeous. All 
right, guys. I'm actually going to take some pictures now, so I will uh, join you guys on the other side. All right, guys, I got some pictures in. Here's uh, where I was telling you the course. You can see the flagging where all the SUVs, or not SUVs, the ATVs go. <laughs> but that's where they go, and we are losing a lot of light out here. <laughs> It's okay, it's still fun. We're coming up on the last leg. It's like a swamp back here. Yeah, this is the final section now. It just loops up to the left and it'll take you right back out to the big blue water tower that we saw earlier in the video. All right, guys, I'm going to pause you here, and um, I will continue on at the very end. So I just want to say thanks again for sticking with me through all of this. Sorry if the lighting is shifting. Like I said, we are almost out of time here with the sun, so I'm going to try to speed it up so I don't do my outro in the uh, dark. Yeah, stay with me and uh, I'll continue continue on when I get to the end. All right, guys. We're here at the end. Wow. Love the sky. I'm so happy I came this late. <laughs> but yeah, this is the end of the trail. take you out and then if there's enough light we will uh, we'll take you back down to the reservoir for one more look maybe get a look at the pump houses so just stick with me and I will uh, I'll get us there guys I'll get us there There's the pump house straight ahead. Sorry, I'm shaking, but going down gravelly hill. All right, guys, I'll pause you here because I have to go on a pretty steep incline. And I will join you back on top of the reservoir. So, okay, so we made it out of the woods. We're just crossing now, right above the reservoir. Oh, sorry about that jumpiness. Our friend is still here. Let me see if I can zoom in. There's our friend the beaver. Just swimming around. But yeah, that's the hike. Like I said, you get it done within an hour. I was taking pictures and filming, so it took me a little longer, but we made it. A little bit of sun left. But yeah, absolutely stunning out. Take a walk down this little hill here.
and that is the pump house. Not a lot of fish from this area, but still a gorgeous place to take a walk and go look at everything. Now I'll take you to the edge of the reservoir and take a look at the spillover. Absolutely breathtaking. You here in person and seeing this? I'll leave you with that view. <laughs> Beautiful. Absolutely stunning. And that concludes it, guys. That's that's the Dunmore Reservoir hike. Well everyone, that wraps up the hike of Dunmore Reservoir number one. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I enjoyed making it. Like I said, I always love going for a hike, seeing nature, seeing everything, everything beautiful our, uh, our area has to offer. So, like I said, I thank you very much for watching. If you want, please subscribe, like, and um, we'll see you in the next one. Thank you guys.